Hello and welcome to Permit Room. My name is Hriday Ranjan. And I am Sai Santosh. And this is the first episode and we have with us our first ever guest, Mr. Praveen Sataru. Hi Thank Hriday. You. Thank you. Hi Hriday sir. Santosh. Um, all the very best. I'm excited. Thanks for inviting me as your first guest. Thank yeah. you. I hope it all works out for you. you know? yeah. uh, yeah. So we couldn't give you a like, banging introduction you were like, you know, <laughs> to keep uh, <laughs> national award this. winner. No, no, it's not. Okay. So... Um, Mr. Praveen Sitaru is a national award winning uh, director. Um, you won uh, the national award for best Telugu film in 2014. Right. For yes. Mama Gadal. Correct. And uh, he's also been uh, uh, a filmmaker for the last 10 years. Actually more than that. 12, 12 years. 12 years now. I, I, I think. Yeah. 2011, is 11. 2011 was your first movie. And uh, there's a personal connection because uh, you were the topic uh, for my MPhil thesis. Oh, what? Seriously? Yeah. <laughs> As in like you this along with, uh, it was 2014-15 in uh-huh. the University of Hyderabad. Okay. So my MPhil topic was, it was called Software Filmmakers. <laughs> so, wow. Oh, yeah. I topics for yeah. 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 And, uh, Good. So uh, basically I was studying this trend at that time. There was a trend. Actually okay. you were kind of, uh, you, Shekhar Kamala, Krish Correct. and uh-huh. Devakata Deva were these people who... Fulfilled the Telugu dream of being an engineer, <laughs> right? <laughs> Fulfilled the parents' pressure of, right. you know, going to the US, doing a right. job, right. but you couldn't kill the filmmaking dream inside you. So you all like did courses, learned filmmaking, became indie filmmakers and came back. So there is a slight difference, a okay. slight change, slight uh, deviation from that. Correct. Uh, probably Deva and Shekhar Kamala and all those guys, probably they fulfilled their dreams of the parents and then <laughs> because they couldn't kill their passion towards cinema they came back I came back to cinema because I didn't know what I wanted to do I was I, I was bored of my life in the US okay. so that's why I came it's not like I wanted to make films you know okay. uh, growing up so I don't know. say that so we are hyping you up for the <laughs> Oh, no, okay. no, don't say it, cut it down. <laughs> no, no, please go on, I'm sorry for interrupting. No, 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 go ahead, go ahead, yeah. No, so, but then, uh, yeah, so what I wanted to say was why I was studying you four people specifically because uh, I thought that was so unique and in a way, you guys walked so that people like Tarun Bhaskar and others can fly today because nowadays there is a trend that you finish your engineering and then you get into filmmaking, right? Hmm. Huh, I think the trend ended 10 years ago, I would say. Okay. Mm. See, or 20 years ago when we were engineers. Huh. So, mm. 90s low, you have to fulfill your parents' dreams. Correct. Uh, and then, uh, and then okay, once you're financially stable, once you, you know, satisfy your parents, can well, chuta lo, okay, ma, what do you ask? Ma, what do you ask? I been work, this is a good thing. Now you do whatever you want to do. Correct. Now, this generation, you know, the millennials and the Zs, mm. uh, they can do whatever they want to do. Correct, yeah. You don't have to parents' dreams parents oh, right. and the parents are also uh, in a way that you know whatever you want to do, um, mm-hmm. you know, just go ahead and pursue. Um, so uh, that's it's we've changed, generations have changed. Uh, two, three generations have come after you know 90s basically, every five, seven years. I think today's kids are more much more have they have clarity. Yeah. Back then we lacked a little clarity because we were torn between two worlds. Correct. Uh, now we are like like, you know, um, living is not a big deal. Mm. Quality of living is a big deal. Correct. Yeah. You know, uh, quality of lifestyle is a big deal. Meaning, Correct. I'm not talking about uh, maintenance of lifestyle. I'm talking about uh, mental health. Mm. Correct. That is a big deal. Yeah. Uh, so, mm. you know, where do you want to go for a vacation? And uh, how do you want to, you know, and uh, stay, stay chilled? You know, not take too much stress. Yeah. That's so you could do that or this generation could do that because... Of what we did, what our parents did, and their parents mm. did. Correct. Yeah, yeah. So we came from 1947 independence of Chinnapur. This our nation was nothing. Yeah. Now we are everything in the world. Yeah. We are the most sought after nation, um, and uh, you know uh, you can stand right you know in front of a, 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 an Englishman and say in his face that you screwed us up for uh, 20, 200 years. Correct. And then still, you know, he would say, I'm sorry, and then walk away. That, those are the times. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so a lot changed. It's it's exciting period for, for India especially. Correct. Yeah. Correct. Um, it's interesting that you brought up mental health. Mental health. Because let me just introduce uh, our podcast a little bit and what is the motto we are going mm. with. Mm. So, it's called Permit Room. So, okay. generally people mm. assume that we, we talk about booze and stuff like that. <laughs> but that is not the case. Okay. Um, so, 
the motto that we are going with is a gentle humorous way okay to make your life better oh nice beautiful right that's you know that's required Thank and you, rightly yeah. you picked up uh, mental health this is permit to <laughs> cheers <laughs> yeah yeah so the so generally we found that in a lot of interviews people already ask about their background their struggles mm. you know those emotional things mm. which we don't particularly want to okay we want to touch on that because we can't better something that already mm. rk has done right. and you right. know other right. people right. at tnr have done right. so we are thinking that uh, we will make an a podcast that focuses on four things specifically because okay. we feel that every person who is successful has nailed four aspects of their life okay right which is um, their time management mm-hmm. yes which is their money management right which is their physical health, physical health. okay and their mental mm-hmm. health wow right there's good ones actually it's yeah. so hard to manage all four exactly yeah. the time management if you get time management if you can manage time mm-hmm. you can be successful correct uh, mm-hmm. at least you can do whatever you wanted to do or want to do correct you can you can get there correct uh, but as a creative person i would say creative people are very bad at money management correct yeah yeah you, you can't you know there's a two sides of you know two parts of your brain why is that though like that's your left brain and right brain correct so you if you are if you are financially strong meaning if you are street smart you are not creative correct because mm. you know everything you have to you can't follow your heart yeah you're mm. not a dreamer you're not like, a yeah. dreamer correct mm-hmm. so a dreamer is always a dreamer you mm. a dreamer can't be practical correct yeah. so those are two different sides yeah. a producer can't be a writer director correct mm. uh, so a writer director can't be a producer correct. if you are both then you have a very limited self life mm. where you might be lucky correct in, you know in getting your success but mm. but yeah you made your money you know Yeah, and you're gone. Correct. So that's why the longest-standing creative people are legends who you know uh, who are there for the longest time. There are people who come, you know, rise um, above all, and then they fall and they go, they go into the oblivion. Correct. Yeah. So. Yeah. Um, also, I think the uh, creative people ki endu ko money management custom ante a point pe da. We don't have a particular source of income. స్టాండర్డ్ సోర్స్ ఆఫ్ జాబ్ చేస్తుంటే ఖచ్చితంగా బై థర్టీ నీకు అమౌంట్ పడుతుంది ఇది ఇందులో నీకు అరే రాయి వస్తుంది నీకు మళ్ళీ ఇస్తాం కొంచెం వచ్చినా కూడా యూ కెన్ యూ కుడ్ యూ హియర్ లాడ్ ఆఫ్ క్రియేటివ్ పీపుల్ హూ బికేమ్ సక్సెస్ఫుల్ Uh, who made a lot of money, but then mm-hmm. went back into debts. Yeah. Um, right from Hollywood to oh, no, to you know Telugu. Correct. A lot of people, oh, uh, not no. just film actors or directors, but but artists, yeah. you know, uh, musicians. Mm. Um, and like like said, so they're the dreamers. They live. They're happy. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they're happy. So they see money management is a uh, is a spreadsheet job. Mm. It, yeah. You need um, you know a timetable. uh and you need a specific process that you follow you mm. have to follow rules and regulations creative mm. people don't have follow yeah, rules yeah uh, true but but a lot of people mistake creativity for laziness huh. you no know, people who are lazy like they doesn't want to do work are a simple guy you know chilla but you know that as a go breed two different things you know mm. it, it it comes with passion so when you're passionate about something you hear a lot of these creative people who who work for 24 hours straight without food or water or, or anything that's because it comes from passion but if you're lazy you won't correct mm. so it's you know it's a very fine line mm. uh, how you define yourself and what, mm. what what your dreams are what you want to achieve correct but i think we're getting off topic no that's okay that's okay i mean it's a long form <laughs> yeah. podcast so don't worry but then uh, it's interesting so i always believe that you know children around the world you have puberty and then mm-hmm. you grow up but right. for a telugu kid <laughs> right engineering is your puberty right, right. like right. after you do engineering you find right. your passion and your <laughs> other things but it's interesting that you studied engineering and you were a chip designer for ibm for uh, um, like so i did my engineering in um, electrical electronics mm-hmm. i have no idea what i did mm. um then i wrote my gre to also went to us did my masters there Mm. Uh, so my specialization was in chip design. Okay. So the chips that you get in cell phones, and Motorola, basically, Motorola was my go-to mm. uh, job. Okay. Uh, so after that, then uh, I did some courses and uh, got a job in IBM. So okay. I, what I did in IBM is different from what my master's is. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But that's what we. So are. Uh, we, after we, yeah. we can switch. 
like that totally. so after you quit uh, working then you came to films or you were doing it in the starting first two films parallelly so ipudu interview la kaakunda ite so parante i was bored of life yeah. see um growing up meaning engineering in appudu because triple e was not my thing i always wanted to do architecture hmm. so architecture was five years uh, course course and then nobody had any clue about architecture correct meaning parents correct especially if mm-hmm. i called my father who was in engineering was in chennai mm-hmm. so father phone yes is telugu or english podcast english english, english. Okay. so uh, so called my dad and i said uh, one first year i want switch to architecture and better phone so uh, i mean he didn't have an idea correct. on what i could become you know mm-hmm. studying architecture mm-hmm. um so he thought you know i'm doing okay and you know, i'll ask some instant to find you know find a job he get a job and probably you know he'll be fine mm-hmm. so um so so my confidence level is very low correct uh we okay. i didn't know anything about it but i have to pass you know there's a lot of pressure right correct. so how can i go back home if i don't, if I don't clear my subjects yeah. so you i so my struggle was to pass Uh, uh-huh. Finished my engineering. Correct. In time. Degree. Correct. So degree. You yeah, have a certificate. So, but I had a certificate at the end of the day. Uh, but didn't have confidence to attend interviews or because because this is not what who you are or what you want to do. So hmm. How can you, uh, you know, uh, be genuine about what? And at that time, no clarity under that. I mean, like at, that you don't want to pursue this, and it might be dishonest for you to pursue. Ah, uh, not dishonest. Hmm. I don't want to pursue this because this is not what I'm liking. ఇంక్లైంట్ Side. Hmm. So uh, uh, even today, when I'm stressed out or when I have some free time, um, I I I make plans. Um, so I design my own office. Hmm. Uh, so I like that. I feel that that is therapy. Hmm. Uh, so because I see, I feel that that there is a, it's a puzzle. Hmm. So you, there is a multi there is multiple ways you can design your office. Correct. Depending on your needs and uh, hmm. your wants. Correct. Basically. So when you go to an architecture. Uh, an architect um uh, a common plan you know for everybody yeah, yeah, yeah. but it's you who actually knows what what your you know what your vibe is correct mm-hmm. uh and who you are as a person mm-hmm. so your place should reflect you know True. your your personality right True. so that comes from within so that mm-hmm. i find therapy but so low in confidence um i want to run away from it Oh, yes. oh because you know i i know that there's no future because mm. there's no interview that i could attend so, uh, or you know there's a, a, a little i had a very good like what mali job and andula and oh my god yeah. <laughs> that's a lot mm. so so i gave my dear gr to her i got my visa lucky uh, so i went so be, because my engineering was in electrical engineering i had to take my majors okay in that so that's how i ended up in chip design Okay. Like which I hated, but again I had to finish. Oh. So once I'm done, but but going to US, I I became more independent. Oh. Um, I could see life firsthand. I Correct. used to tell everyone around that time that India lo our time lo now kids are very very smart and they're independent and all that. Um, this is early two thousands and uh, late nineties. Everybody should be shipped to a place like US. Oh. You know, give them like hundred dollars, ten dollars. Mm-hmm. ask them to you know stay for 6 months one year mm-hmm. and then come back and they know what life is oh and, uh, because india law everything comes on a platter on correct on a platter oh, yeah no. even like me and uh, yeah, no. everything no. comes on no. you don't have to do anything still live no. full life correct pelli ese varaku intlone untaru ha pelli ya pelli ya kuda ya it's like good intlone untaru ante kontha mandi jeevithalu ఎప్పుడు పుట్టారు ఎప్పుడు పోయారు బదులుతారు వాట్ ఇట్ యూ డూ నథింగ్ యూనో బట్ యూ జస్ లెట్ యూ లైక్ దే హ్యాపీ ఇన్ దర్ ఓన్ వే బట్ యూనో సో అట్లా దాట్స్ వెర్ ఐ ఫౌండ్ లైక్ ఓకే యూనో ఐ ఫౌండ్ ఫ్రీడమ్ ఐఎమ్ లైక్ ఓకే ఐ కెన్ డూ వాట్ ఎవర్ ఐ వాంట్ టు డూ ఇస్ వెన్ ఐ ఐ దిస్ ఇస్ సాఫ్ట్వేర్ కాల్ ఎస్ఎపి 
Yeah. Hmm. So I I tried to find creative stuff in in whatever I you know I I was pursuing. Okay. Uh, mm-hmm. To find uh, to make myself or my job interesting. Okay. See, okay. you know, if you have a mundane job, you try to find things that will keep you going. Put on leisure and off is kella. Correct. Kella, mm-hmm. you find something that will push you mm-hmm. to go to work. Right? Yeah. So that is how you see in you know, a positive. You know, you mm-hmm. have to find. You have to move forward. You know, mm-hmm. there has to hope is the only thing that keeps you. Shashank 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 Yeah, Yeah, absolutely. So, uh, why do you you wake up in the morning? Because you are hoping to to do X, Y, Z uh, today, tomorrow, near future or far future. Or Correct. Uh, so, if there is no hope, why are you making it? Yeah. So, that's when, so, um, so, it's a it's a financial designing software where you design financial um, uh, software firm. um uh, companies mm-hmm. like these big companies like bmw you know mtv and all this so so you know, so they so i found some creative um um what do you call you know um you know excitement in that mm-hmm. so and again it's not a money as well mm-hmm. so so i tried to find a balance there Correct. so that's how i got into ibm um I think after eight, ten years in IBM, I it, it life became scary hmm. in a way. Yeah. Why? Because you are financially stable. Correct. Uh, you have everything. Yeah. Um, and I could see where I would be in five years with my family and with my financial. Hmm. In ten years with my family and with my financial. Monitor me, Jason. I'm scared. This is not what I want. Correct. I don't want to know what tomorrow holds for me. Yeah. Um, that is more exciting, right? Yeah. 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 Uh, excitement you, both of them. We're going to excitement both of them every weekend. You come and you go to a park. You go, you know, to a movie or Correct. whatever, whatever, whatever. Yeah. You know, you plan a vacation every six months. Mm. You plan an India trip every one year. Yeah. Um, and that's it. It's mm. it just becomes a spreadsheet. Yeah. So that's scary. Uh, yeah. You know, that's a cycle. People, for some people, it's the best thing to yeah. you know to happen. Correct. So it depends on your personality, yeah. right? Yeah. 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 Uh, so that's the difference between a creative, you know, mind and a. Uh, Yeah. So some people say, "Hey, chill. I will yeah. come home, sit, and have my coffee, sleep, go, wake up in the morning, go to this, do the same stuff at office. Yeah, life yeah. is happy." Yeah. So that's why I said, "No, I want to do something." Correct. Uh, just to ask one thing. Yeah. So I think uh, just uh, analyzing because you said this that uh, you were more inclined towards architecture or you designing your office or so that transits into your movies also because your movies have very good production design. So. Always. Uh, yeah, do you give also the production designer a tough time? Like <laughs> <laughs> I give everybody a tough time. Actually, <laughs> that's <a> problem. <laughs> so at a every every film or every um, film, did, you know, it it reflects the director. Yeah, it, yeah, I, yeah. I would yeah. say it it has to reflect the director. Yeah, uh, it, 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 it does. Yeah, it does. Um, for for me, it reflects me. Yeah. Um, you know the 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 subject I choose or. um you know the locations that i choose or the 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 production design mm-hmm. or even the camera angles or the tone of the film or mm-hmm. you know everything reflects me as a personality mm-hmm. i i say it's an extension of me mm-hmm. uh, and that's when it becomes my film yeah um i would not want to venture into unknown unless mm-hmm. i learn that unknown mm-hmm. and own it mm-hmm. um like that it just becomes like i don't know Okay, let's see what happens. I, I, that's a very correct. This is the uh, Pravin Sathar that maybe put Kota ke jostna. Antak mundu how I related even more okay. was LPW apuru chase na apuru apuru relationship stories equal level. Tell me. Okay. Oh, yeah. That was one of the first uh, uh, relationship stories like a two triangle stories. Okay, da kada, okay, da kada. Unrelated to each other. If you're related to them, we have a thing. Right. Can you dance with the chindwa mukha thelu? Right. Atla onna puru. Asi re. And kujum touchy onta ega da. Atla subjects. I was too naive then. <laughs> <laughs> See once once you. you so that was also uh, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Please. So that was also your face. Like that time you were around. Like you know stories come from what you are. Right. Personally. So my first so, story, LBW, is a story of my friends. Uh, oh. Two sets of friends. <laughs> uh, so uh, Das Lai story is a friend uh, um, of mine. Um, so the female uh, lead is is my friend. Ekada India Lai story is the male one. Okay. 
Okay. So, uh, clubbing those stories was my idea, yeah. uh, but those are two stories that happened to my friends. So, oh, wow. from, so from uh, there, then it moved to now. From PSV, you've taken a. Uh, not taken a, uh, but I. I or you chose to, like I that's your like you said reflection. Ha! See, one thing is I try to take whatever comes. To, it's like you know, it uh, depends on my mood, mm-hmm. <laughs> basically. So, what are you in the mood to write? Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, so, I wrote Kuntu Takis because mm-hmm. I was very frustrated, very unhappy, you know, with the result of Chanam Gadalu and uh, I, you know, out of frustration, Kuntu Takis. Mm-hmm. Um, so, Kuntu Takis, PSP was written, was my first script that I wrote in 2007 mm-hmm. uh, oh. when I wanted to write stories or, you know, get into films or what I didn't know why I was going to get into films. Mm-hmm. I thought I'll just write some stories. Mm. Uh, just for to uh, bore work in the office. Mm. <laughs> so, so what do I do? Uh, I do to keep myself creatively engaged. Yeah. Right, you have to be sane. Right? You can't become yeah. insane. Um, so to keep yourself charged up, I I used to start. You know, I used to imagine stories. And I was always a guy, a uh, wise guy. You know, so, uh, Chennai is my engineering. Mm. So. Train travel was uh, 18 hours. Uh-huh. Correct. Yeah. So you read all those books and... <laughs> read books and I can sit and stare out of the window and then entertain myself. Oh. Without doing anything. Correct. And we men, we can zone out. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. You know, women uh-huh. don't understand. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we can zone out. We yeah. can just sit and entertain ourselves, do nothing. True. So I'm, I'm either very, very, very busy. I'd like to be on my toes or I don't want to do anything. Mm. There's no in between. Correct. Like I'm lazy and sitting on the couch all day, four days, five days. I don't mind. Oh. Um, if I'm working, it's like 24 seven. I don't want to even take a break. Correct. So it's that those extremes are not. So um, lost the question. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, the so stories that came around. Ah, uh, uh, stories. Yeah. So those that those were the stories of my. Uh, God yeah. Vega was written in What's 2007. It uh-huh. uh, was my first script and. Um, uh, but Jeevita Garu and Rashi Garu asked me to write something for them. Asked, mm-hmm. uh, um, I said, I see Rashi Garu. For me, Rashi Garu's image is Magadu. Um, Magadu is what stuck in mm-hmm. my head. So I would write something like that. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, I can't write a family story. Mm-hmm. So that's all. And they said, no, no, no bars. You can just go all out and write whatever comes to your wildest imagination. Mm-hmm. So that was... You know, that's a very rare uh, freedom that you get. Correct. Um, and uh, and I said, let's go all out and see what we can. Hmm. We were very scared uh, of how to pull that. Because, you know, I don't give on the office. You yeah. know, once you taste yourself, coffee or something, it's How do you execute it? That's, that's where planning comes in. Mm-hmm. So that's where my job helped me. Mm-hmm. Uh, so my job helped me shape me to manage uh, on, on execution, concept, yeah. execute it, mm. then plan it properly. Right. Mm. So those who have jobs actually sometimes like I have a lot of friends who are in jobs, right. mm. and they always feel like they are wasting their time because they have not yet become a filmmaker uh-huh. yet. Uh-huh. But yeah. I always feel <laughs> that no, you are always picking up some skills, correct. Right? Correct. right? Because a director's job is a project management no, job. Absolutely. Mm. absolutely. Because absolutely. you have a workforce of 200 to 150 people, correct. it is mm. like. So I would say those 10 years of working with IBM and doing my engineering and uh, my master's is not a waste of time. Mm. Uh, It's a learning experience. See, that's what I always tell you. Every day you're learning something. Irrespective of whether you like what you're doing in that atmosphere or not, Mm. you take away something. Mm. You should take away something. Correct. It's, you know, not to put yourself in that situation again. Is one takeaway, but what can I learn from this mm. and Correct. apply? Correct. So, engineering taught me. Um, I was always good with with geometry, growing up and all that. So, I would camera angles, gani lights, gani. You know how a light diffusion happens. Mm. You know, where do you have to put a light to you know to get a particular shadow? Mm. So these things, director tells the emo than that cinematographers people even know. Oh, <laughs> so that's, that's the problem my cinematographer was faced with me. <laughs> so even before they set up the cameras, I tell them the character, the character. They have to some people have to go through the process of putting it somewhere else and then shifting. Correct. I kind of cut that. 
ఓకే సో ఐ టెల్ ది మై వర్క్ దిస్ దిస్ చెప్పేసి వెళ్ళిపోతాను సో దట్ కమ్ ద మైట్ నాట్ కమ్ అక్రాస్ యాస్ యు నో యాస్ బట్ ఐ వాంట్ టు సే ఇట్స్ అబౌట్ సేవింగ్ టైం యా సో సేవ్ టైం అండ్ దెన్ పుట్ ఇట్ హియర్ ఇట్స్ 60 డిగ్రీ యాంగిల్ రోడ్ యు నో యు నో ఇల్ యు నో బ్యాక్ మిర్రర్ ఉంది సో దోస్ విల్ నాట్ ఎడిట్ ఇన్ మిర్రర్ ఇట్స్ ఇట్స్ సింపుల్ మ్యాథ్ అండ్ సైన్స్ సో ప్రయర్ యు డిడ్ంట్ వర్క్ ఎనీవేర్ లైక్ ఫిల్మ్ ఎక్స్‌పీరియన్స్ directly uh, was uh, inevitable uh, yeah i don't yeah. know don't ask me why i did that how i did that no, uh, directly i guess i was crazy man yeah. no that's true and um, like that was what my mfil topic was uh-huh. that all these people who had no precedent right. because before mm-hmm. that the story was you have to come to krishna nagar be somebody's ad <laughs> you know mm-hmm. but then you guys cannot get that no but uh, we have a few interesting questions we'll just try to light up the Absolutely. board a little bit uh, so one thing hasn't changed since you were a student and today's student okay. days which is that engineering is still a very popular thing yeah. <laughs> right but we are very curious like what was engineering back then like back then, yeah know? like uh, that and ipude the mark tinder bumble even unnai oh how was dating tinder bumble ah and the engineering was know. slow and what was like ante did you have to take your jatakam and go and date <laughs> i'm sorry for dating ledha dating ledha so ka ipude engineering college lo No, but you have a mile and a mile. I'll tell you what. Because now you have a mile and a mile. How old are you? How, when was your last uh, degree? We are in 2007 degree pass. Uh, it's yeah. again trial, trial time. Yeah, yeah. So now you have an engineering college or any college. Hmm. You can say, what do you want to do? Hi. Yeah. I mean, you can just directly go and say hi. Correct. Right. And so on and so on. Yeah. You don't have to do that. You don't have to push yourself. పంపించారంటే మార్నింగ్ బ్రేక్ మధ్యాహ్నం లంచ్ బ్రేక్ మళ్ళీ మధ్యాహ్నం ఇంకో బ్రేక్ కాలేజ్ అయిపోయాడు ఈ ఫోర్ టైమ్స్ హీ వుడ్ కమ్ టు మీ హీ వుడ్ అప్డేట్ మీ వాట్ హ్యాపన్ ఇన్ హిస్ క్లాస్ హీ వుడ్ సీ దిస్ అమ్మా ఒక అమ్మాయి ఉండేది అమ్మాయి అమ్మ ఫ్రెండ్ చూసి వీడి పని అమ్మాయి చూడడం అంతే సో బ్రేక్ లో అమ్మాయి చూస్తుంటే అమ్మాయి చూసింది అమ్మాయి సో కుచు కుచు పోతే సినిమా రిలీజ్ అయింది ఐ థింక్ ఫస్ట్ టైం షారుక్ ఖాన్ వోర్ దోస్ జిప్పర్ ఫోర్ఇయర్స్పోక్టర్లీ happened to be my friend okay um second year no oh. so he would come and talk to me oh. he would not ask me to introduce him also correct and i answer amma to maatadala ane dhairyam oda undedu ga correct this pakkana unte sir pothunna ante amma chustadu amma chustu gadipe sir for years rodeem cinema what is rodeem ana cinema i don't know if you remember uh, it's a beautiful film big it same same story <laughs> so that how that's how it used to be back then correct um but there are ante alanti vallu kuda unnaru ippudu kuda unnaru but you know lot men usually mature a little slower than women yeah. so, right you know um, that's something you're in touch with your uh, engineering friends now uh, yeah, yeah i think most of them are new as uh oh, yeah really there's a group uh-huh. <laughs> oh now this is a group what's that group correct uh, <laughs> correct <laughs> uh so uh, here's my next question um uh, which is like um if you were to give um 
there might be a lot of aspiring filmmakers right mm. and many of you of them who actually pursued a career path like yours which is like you know to do engineering have a job and they are kind of deciding mm. between you know mm. taking the plunge because i feel like every telugu person somewhere deep in their mind wants to be a filmmaker mm. in some way or other like yeah, yeah. you don't wonder right i don't know i feel like maybe because our for us art is cinema mm. right. right right like like mm. yeah like for tamil people or malayalam people yeah. i think they have dance and their music mm. and their literature and mm. theater for us everything mm. is for us writing is mm. cinema yeah. for us music is cinema dance but culture lo undi pen telugu question question um if writing is cinema then then if the upcoming writers are going to start no where are the learning to write from from cinema only that's the problem i am ఏమో మరి అదే అదే ఇప్పుడు లిటరేచర్ లేదు తెలుగులో దేర్ ఇస్ నో మోర్ లిటరేచర్ కరెక్ట్ సి యూ యూ వెన్ ఆర్ ద గ్రేట్ రైటర్స్ ఇన్ తెలుగు వెన్ డిట్ ది లెవ్ లైక్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఇట్ ఈస్ నైన్టీస్ కరెక్ట్ ఎర్లీ నైన్టీస్ కి రైటర్స్ అనే నైన్టీస్ రావాల రైజర్ నో రైటర్స్ కరెక్ట్ కరెక్ట్ తెలుగు maybe no. endemuri was the last of those yeah, no. yeah, endemuri garu is also a very commercial writer correct uh-huh. you know yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. like like chetan bhagat yeah yeah yeah, yeah. he was yeah. the original chetan yeah, bhagat yeah yeah he's yeah. right personal chetan bhagat yeah. yeah. but you know uh, sulochana rani you know there's uh, so there's so many, i don't even you know uh, yeah. so that's how bad i am also correct. but literature is gone yeah. i would say telugu yeah. literature is dead it's dead for 20 years correct it's a very unfortunate fact that uh cinema writing or watching cinemas and learning to write or watching cinema and learning to narrate stories that that is not you know how it should be yeah. uh you know that's not how life is that's the reason why i think as films the films are becoming more regressive now mm-hmm. we're going back what what is working right now is only masala films correct mm-hmm. see to, i think 2000 to 2015 16 before covid was a period where a lot of experimentation happened True. you yeah. know you, you people used to watch all kinds of cinema True. now you see hindi lo kuda a lot of ex, you know nice films came yeah. in that decade yeah yeah, yeah. That, you know 10 12 15 years mm-hmm. now we've corrupted hindi also yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah no i mean i feel hindi corrupted us because and they see they are the bigger industry no no kadu what films worked in the last 3 years correct correct mm. all the biggest blockbusters in the world oh, yeah. in, in 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 india yeah yeah uh, okay. right uh, from south to north mm. what are the films choose there all are masala films all are masala films correct right? so people are not even watching uh, at a decent films could have option led correct like, okay bane undi ki option led it's like it has to be either you know great highs mm. all highs తెలుగు culture is going back to thousands of years where do we come from our history man nechukuntene it's today it will be in us uh, and then going forward we'll take it with us if we keep forgetting you know what our culture is where we come from correct then what we le- do is what we learn what we sante kada if 90s lo cinema chusi 2000s lo directors influence ayya correct Right. Oh, uh, just imagine 20 years later they'll get influenced by this. Already it's mm-hmm. gone. Yeah. Already, if you look at the cinema, I would say somebody comes in, a lot of people, 99% of, of directors and writers, they, you ask them, uh, what do you do you know, when, you, when, you, when you're not writing or making films? Or what is your daily routine? You can't do cinema, you can't do cinema, you can't do cinema, you can't do cinema, you can't do cinema. Correct. You can't do cinema. You can't do cinema. You can't do cinema. Where are you learning? What? stories where are you what is your learning curve from watching films that what you films are just you know uh, that's not what life is that's not what hap- what's happening outside right mm. you learn yeah. from somewhere else and you implement it in cinema yeah so yes, that's yes. that's where we lack in so apatlo mm. మూవీస్ ఫార్టీ డే ఆర్ ఫిఫ్టీ డే కి అరే ఇది బాగుంది పోయి చూడొచ్చు అనే ఒక ఫీలింగ్ ఉండేది లైక్ సమ్ మూవీస్ మెల్లగా స్లో హిట్స్ అంటే స్లీపర్ హిట్స్ అనేవారు 
Now I don't know. So I wanted to just take your perspective. Uh, that's a different. I think again, it's a different uh, subject altogether. Hmm. Um, well, everything is fast paced these days. It's freaking. I didn't just spend that much. I didn't just spend that much, and then instant gratification. Hmm. You see, today's generation wants. I want an ice cream right now. I need it now. Correct. Right. So I deserve it. See, it's 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 more of an American mentality hmm. where you deserve it. Mm. You're worth it. I deserve mm. it. I wor- I'm worth it. Mm. You know, I need to treat myself. Correct. So it's slowly cut into you know. Yeah. To Make yourself great again. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Nice. So, but you have to change with the changing times. Mm. Uh, that's why promotions have become so important, right? Back then there were no promotions. Correct. Right Correct. now you need to pro- you know promote the shit out of your films. Yeah. Uh, so that you have the opening numbers. Once you have the opening numbers, if it's good, good. Mm. If it's not, well, it's a weekend. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So now, uh, how do you d- decide a movie by the box office numbers, or is it a movie uh, born in? How do you decide it's a hit or flop? Um, me or how in saying, general? Yeah, I'm saying your perspective. <laughs> um, see, trailer chodanga na teaser trailer uh, will give me a vibe. Me, I don't watch too many films. Mm. I watch very selective film, and my time is very very important. Uh, and I don't want to waste my time in, in, in watching. Mm. You know, stupid stuff. Mm. So when I watch a teaser and a trailer, I'll get a vibe. Okay, this is something that I would want to watch. Mm. So ne first day le type pura gada. I'm a very bad movie lo- uh, goer. Mm. Uh, not the, the typical, you know. So first day, kuni kuni cinema lo cinema baale ganna kora I'll go watch like um, forgot the name. Nani is in Las Vegas. ఉంటారా You know, hmm. you know, I don't know about you. I don't. I, I can't say about people because what we see or hear is is what what the media projects, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, I love the film. It's a tad bit long, so what? You know, it's tad. It's, uh, you know, yeah. Um, but so no, I also like that it. is craft. Mm-hmm. Um, so though that I you know trailer showing that I like, I want to watch. Mm-hmm. Uh, but problem in it, a lot of people don't go to theaters because of a lot of things that they hear. Correct. Uh, or they are fed. Mm-hmm. It's all about. feeding it's all about feeding not even promotion it's feeding correct oh. basically so negative undi positive undi so how much you pump into positive to overshadow the negative hmm. for people to come and watch, watch yeah so that is something that the producers have to believe in hmm. and not believe in they should realize that this is how the game is yeah. hmm. uh, so once you do that then hmm. so yeah hmm. so so what is your morning routine on the day of your release ah on the day of my release nice right. question actually <laughs> yeah. it's been it's changed over a period of time okay mm-hmm. it's changed um lbw i still remember um i was i, I didn't get a theater in uh, uh, hyderabad uh, mm-hmm. that was that was the first Digital, all digital film to release. It is called the multiplex film also. Ha, okay. yeah. First movie. First, first multiplex film, and then it was shot on red one, first digital camera. Okay. Ah, uh, and then print sale. The print key, print uh, each print cost seventy thousand and so. So I didn't have the money to put a print. So a lot of theaters were not equipped to project digitally. Okay. okay. So print it well. So ah, uh, Vice Admiral Theatre door kind of Vijayala door kind of Hyderabad door they didn't have any theaters. Ah, uh, mm-hmm. you know to. to showcase that really? kompalli was one theater oh ah uh, then narayan guda lo narayan guda theater lo projector mana uh, office room projectors unde correct mm-hmm. so our project oh wow <laughs> cd petti per screen meda screen the oh. night before i went i saw i said <laughs> i looked it like seriously mm-hmm. what are na ko pura na ko pura dokle actually sorry but uh, uh, i we downloaded whole night kuch no, 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 i tell you i there's story to that why you were able to download it also so 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 on the day of the release you know i was i drove uh, to the theater 
పదిహేను మంది ఇరవై మంది క్రికెట్ కూడా ఉంటారు దిస్ అండ్ దెన్ దే వాచింగ్ దాట్ లైక్ దిస్ ఇస్ అండ్ దిస్ ఇస్ హౌ యు నో వాట్ ఇట్ కేమ్ డౌన్ టు సో అండ్ దెన్ ఫ్యూ డేస్ లేటర్ ఐ సెట్ పుట్ ఇట్ ఆన్ యూట్యూబ్ or oh, you know there okay. the downloads out to nahi there is the pirates ochindante let it go rampant and mm-hmm. i want this film on everybody's laptop oh that's why manchi hd print la unde appudlo cd lo itla chuste side mein chepa not like there is yeah, cross no, it, camera print i said release it i want people to watch so that way it came little are chaala manchi hd print ay video video ante chudu chudu ante it is it was surprising like appudu kottane kada now no sir and i have met a lot of people over the last 10 years who said it, that they had a, a print on their laptop yeah, yeah. downloaded and so which I, which was a very deliberate thing i said i'm not going to make any money out of it mm-hmm. let people watch it you know so i agenda fulfill i think yeah. it went on everyone's laptop yeah, yeah. so it was ott before ott <laughs> it was already free for ott yeah for ott <laughs> so um one more question i wanted to ask you slightly digressing from that you actually were the first person who noticed siddhu janal gadda's talent ha huh, yeah right like you gave him a lead role in two two movies of yours i was naive <laughs> 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 um i did auditions for see i was i, I should say i was uh, i was naive i cannot say I'm, uh, i was genuine because not knowing everything actually makes you genuine automatically correct mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. If you know the entire picture, you cannot be genuine. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Then you will weigh your, you know. Yeah. Uh, and you will yeah. take lesser risks also. I yeah, you will. Mm-hmm. Right. So now I wouldn't take that risk. Yeah. Um, but um, you know, back then when I just came from US, finished my shoot in US, came down. Um, I I I put up auditions. Uh, so auditions lo situ uh, came through and abhi. You know, oh. these are the two guys. I oh, through auditions only. Ah, through auditions. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, um, auditions, and then I picked those two guys, and then you know, uh, and that happened. Correct. So, after no joke, sir, first in my mind, that we traveled through the yeah. first film. So, um, you know, so that that kind of continued. Correct. Mm-hmm. So, good to talk is. Ah, so good to talk is with you and Acharya uh, Kalu Vidya Bhushan. Mm-hmm. So yeah. no, but my question more specifically was yeah. like now. He is kind of the famous guy with an indie spirit, right? Like he has yeah. taken forward what you guys started off with, no, because yeah. his movies are not your typical commercial movie. He has his own thing going, right? Right. right? right. So what was it you saw in him back then that right. you thought that okay, there is probably a star quality or an actor quality to the ah, person? See, for that, see, I I saw my character in him hmm. in LBW. So oh. and that same thing carried to Bundu um, Takis. Mm. so he that what you see in or what you saw in dj tillu is who he is oh that's how he that's is in real life okay he is like he is an entertainer mm. uh, so he light up a room and he he always has a, a trick up his sleeve mm. um and always he he has these one liners he mm. he has great pick up lines he's he's just you know full on he is dj tillu he is he's dj tillu that's him <laughs> So I think whatever dialogues he says, that's him. Yeah. That's the, he's he, that's what he is. So it's very easy to know when you see somebody. There's a lot of positivity around him. Correct. Um, you know, um, I know you know the struggles that he has gone through to be where he is today. Doesn't? Correct. It didn't come easy. You know, Gundu Taki style alone. We 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 both went through a lot uh, to make that film happen. Oh. Uh, we had to fight a lot. People used to come to me by by Sidhu. వేరేవల్ తీసుకుంటే సేల్ అవుతుంది కదా ఈవెన్ ఆ సినిమా డబ్బింగ్ టైమ్ లో కూడా సమ్ ఆఫ్ ది యాక్టర్స్ వర్క్ ఇన్ ద ఫిల్మ్ కేమ్ సార్ బాగానే ఉంది సినిమా కానీ ఎవరు చూస్తారు సార్ సో ఆల్ దాట్ సో హీ వెంట్ టు లాట్ వైల్ షూటింగ్ ఆఫ్ ద ఫిల్మ్ వైల్ ఇన్ ద ప్రాసెస్ ఆఫ్ మేకింగ్ ఇట్ అండ్ ఆల్ హీ అండర్స్టాండ్ దట్ యు నో నో బడి వై వుడ్ ఎనీబడి యు నో గివ్ మీ దట్ బట్ బట్ ఛానల్ దోస్ you know everything into in you know focus it and yeah. then try to achieve what your dream is yeah, or become somebody then automatically everything you kind know, of comes yeah, yeah. For, uh, and finally he wrote his own stuff yeah i think that's what he finally that's what yeah. no yeah. he he designed his destiny and he, yeah, yeah, yeah. so gulda is not here and i we were you know we uh, we both were frustrated in, in, 
and then we rode while you know we drove the car is going we both were driving through the city uh, just frustrated <laughs> so it's it's a good uh, therapy when you drive through uh, <laughs> uh, you have to be patient and yell at people yeah you know, honk at people yeah take all your frustration of, uh, and yeah. also when you cross hussain sagar you have to do pranayama pranayama <laughs> <laughs> the smell is so bad <laughs> no but uh, here's my other uh, question i not a question really but i'll tell you a funny incident related oh, to gundu talk is i was coming in a bus from vizag to hyderabad okay and they were playing gundu talk oh shit right i wouldn't <laughs> no but i think like many of your movies uh, the memories are like in laptops or buses <laughs> or something like the true sign of an indie filmmaker i guess you never see him in theaters but uh, but then gundu talk is actually worked very well in the bus so oh, it did okay yeah. right and people enjoyed it how i know that is that the film got over right so uh-huh. then what do they do they play another movie right so they put on some other movie oh yeah and one old man from the back shouted hey multiple times in the old man in a bus in a uh. bus oh <laughs> gundu talk oh god so maybe that was your target audience all along and you just didn't identify it. ah no no true um actually while promoting the film mm-hmm. also we were very clear that you know this is a film that you watch it with your buddies mm-hmm. you know not with your family Correct. so mm-hmm. you know uh, because we know what we made and yeah. like, who we made it uh, yeah. for basically yeah. so siddu uh, nenu and rashmi um, we went to a theater to promote uh, to see you know weekend saturday yeah. um, i think shiva parvati theater mm-hmm. uh, and oka uh, oka family which they were like mother and two daughters and um and i i went to them i said uh, don't don't want watch it here. Uh, uh this is not a film for you to uh, watch together mm-hmm. um uh, and and uh, our tickets amme vadiki cheppal kada no you should tell them right mm-hmm. it will be that they, they might like it you know mm-hmm. in a different scenario yeah, right? uh, but not not here with, band, yeah. uh, with all, all the men in the theater and all that and tane one and sir every saturday vallu regular theater oh. <laughs> so i'll reserve four tickets for them every saturday yeah, right, to yeah, whatever right. film that plays so i went to told them i might probably this is not a film to watch it now correct uh, so send them off so atla you know um, people might have good experience with the bad experience with the film correct. you know i had somebody call from us on a talk show uh, you know venting it out like how can you do this is not <laughs> but i had people calling from uh, uh and and meeting and they say this is this is what happens you know yeah. i've seen these things happen like mm-hmm. and then you kind of portrayed it right and i said i most half of the stuff that you know that that you see in my films are derived from what i saw mm. what i've experienced what my friends experienced what i saw someone else someone else experiencing it that's how you know you incorporate in the film so mm. you have to first experience life right so that's why going back to literature mm. you yeah. need to study you need to see what life is you need to see what society is about you need to experience experience your downs and your rock bottoms yeah. and your highs somewhere else in your life Mm-hmm. so that you can translate into a story that you want to narrate correct then it becomes a genuine story correct um another quick question um where like you seem to be quite a cricket fan i i am oh, how do you know that i mean one is like you were very specific about finishing it before the match begins <laughs> and also your movie is called lbw so oh, right. it doesn't seem like i just made the connection so do you think india is going to win the world cup oh yes absolutely it's destined india is going to win the world cup yeah it's it's, it's all signs are showing that yeah, right, leading right, to yeah. that yeah, yeah. my only fear is like manam semi finals lo koncham tadavadakopothe then the cup is ours say that but then let's see our our team ante manalu pressure teeskona time ki the See, one time you when you the, want them to perform the smart thing that they're doing now is they because they don't want to take pressure they are finishing the match without taking pressure yeah, oh, that's good. yeah. they are setting their innings oh, no. pacing their innings in a way that we don't have to take pressure let's Correct. not take pressure that last yeah. 10 15 year yeah. 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 over stretch our, our last 50 balls lo mm-hmm. 60 runs ivanni mm-hmm. odman correct pace it right mm-hmm. you know yeah, in yeah. a way that it is smoothly that when you are actually watching the match you are you are little you know worried but when you see the highlights in in this i can understand correct because they are so i see lot of maturity in the team mm. lot of maturity right um and from the past experiences 
Mm. Right. So that maturity is translating into into the game. It so, doesn't matter if it's you know we crashed Australia. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're struggling to come back. Yeah. Into, yeah. You know, um, it doesn't matter if it's South Africa. If it's you know Dikar is hitting sixes out of the park. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Our bowlers are mature. Yeah. Somebody wisely said, uh, uh, you know, great batting lineup wins you matches, but great. Bowling lineup wins you tournaments. Mm. Okay. We have a great bowling lineup. We have intelligent bowl bowlers. Yeah. We have thinking bowlers. Yeah, yeah. That's the that's the great uh, great thing that that has yeah. happened for our team. Correct. We, the cup is ours. And also, like from two thousand three, if I remember, we were a very fear. India was a like a very scary chasing team. Namma ko mundey dikha do India mein chase yes sir. And now, if you look at all our matches, we've yeah. chased all the matches. Now, now you want for a chase, we are more comfortable. Yeah, more comfortable. No, exactly. I'll tell you what. That comes from you see the overall trend yeah. of um, of who we are as Indians, where we came from, how we evolved. We it's the same trend in every field, right? Mm. You know, in filmmaking, taking our films to Oscars. Correct. Yeah. Uh, 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 to Our tech industry to you know our attitude, mm. uh, who we are now. It's to cricket, mm. to cricket, exactly. Mm. That's translation yeah, yeah. to cricket as well. Yeah. So we can see when you see the way the, how timid we were in eighties. Yeah. You know, every ball, I mean, you know, that yeah. you know, the yeah. you know yeah. whatever you want to bowl, bowl. Yeah. So yeah. it's the attitude, right? That comes from confidence that builds as a society. Yeah. We built over years, and uh, you know, we went to moon, man. Yeah. Oh, we're going to the sun now, mm-hmm. right? Uh, mm-hmm. uh, so that's how we are as a as a country, yeah. and I'm very proud. These these are the times, you know, mm-hmm. exciting times. And future is. So if India wins the World Cup, we will uh, put out a post saying Pravin Chattaru predicted it. Because predicted. I predicted. <laughs> predicted. Yeah. <laughs> By the so way, because you're a Virat Kohli fan. Um. No, I'm a um, Virat Kohli fan. But if I'm I'm old enough to not be a fan of somebody. Ah, sure. Got it. Got it. Got it. You know, I've I've got all my switches on. Yeah. Right. Like I can't be a fan of. Correct. 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 Um. So I because you have love, then heart has been broken. Like with all of us, then no. So I care to love again. I love my team. I love the Indian team as is now. Correct. Because I don't want to pin my hopes on one person. Because correct. Because mm-hmm. that's not how the team is now. That's because we did that for twenty years. Yeah. yeah. We were only dependent on one yeah. person. Yeah. Yeah. And then such an angle, I want to. I pin two crores in a viewership. Ten lakhs, what are they? Oh, TV lo. So you cried in 2003 World Cup, but that's in that out. Oh my, 2003 good or 96 good? Oh, complete. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. 96. Kolkata, I think 99. 96, I think. 96. Yeah, in gardens lo. In gardens lo. I was traveling from Chennai to Hyderabad. Uh, sorry, Vaisa. That uh, I was in engineering. Uh, that night that we were playing with Sri Lanka. Correct. Um, and like, hey. Sachin was there. Sachin got out. I think Kamli was batting. He cried. Yeah, uh, Kamli cried. Kamli that oh my god, that was, those are the best. Yeah. yeah. And like from that, now you see cricket match today. Mm-hmm. It's like you know, uh, the kids of today are so lucky they don't have to go through that anxiety. Aren't <laughs> 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 they? Like yeah. don't get up. Yeah. yeah. Like your first of all, your father would have weird superstitions, right? Mm. Like don't eat, don't talk, yeah, don't I mean, breathe. Ande ipur ipur guda. Yeah, I've been thinking of like okay, let's have a. You know, a, a match party, uh, call friends, and I'm good now. But mm. then I realized, no, no, no. I watch all India matches in one position <laughs> in my living room. That's where I'm going to sit and watch. Yeah. So that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that's the thing. Like you know, like there is a quote in uh, the office where Michael Scott says, "I'm not superstitious. Yeah. I'm a little superstitious." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it comes to cricket all the time. Yeah. Like, I'm not superstitious, but I'm like, hey, man, don't get up. Like, why? Why? You know what? I'm not superstitious, but I don't want to jinx it either. Yeah. 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 I don't want to do anything wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I don't do right, also fine. But don't want to do anything wrong. Correct. Okay, right. um, so we've come to the last segment where um, we want to give uh, bite-sized, helpful tips to youngsters because I feel like you know most uh, like youngsters of today must be more difficult than what we had. Like they live a more complicated life. Right, because of social media, because of gadgets, oh, because right. of yes. all yes. of because we live a more simpler life. No, no. So yeah. through right. our podcast, through the experts we get in, through all the people who are successful, we are trying to kind of make their lives a little better. Yeah. <laughs> uh, like I said, through those four aspects. So I'll ask you for quick tips uh, that you can probably give um, any youngster who's watching, okay. wants to be a director. Um, number one is uh, 
how do you deal with your mental health if you could give me in short uh, very hard actually um and then you need to find avenues to keep yourself positive you need to find people uh, who will keep you positive um you will have to engage yourself and it's a constant you know a uh, reminder right so see like like they say a relationship is a const you have to put in a lot of effort into relationship correct you correct. can't take a relationship for granted correct either it's having a girlfriend or being married and having a wife uh, or a husband uh, it's once you're married you're not done you have to mm. contribute yeah. so same with mental health as well you there, there has to be a reminder every day in the morning uh, that you know find avenues where you stay yourself positive mm. uh, so um, so it's it's very hard find people who are who are who, who are genuinely uh, you know friends or family or whoever it is mm. or or people who you you know when you see some people you you feel energetic you feel yes. you know this a little positive yeah surround uh, yourself with people you know um and uh, uh, you know to stay positive i'll mm-hmm. i'll give you an example so my last film bomb victory of you know uh, box office so tuesday two months i it felt like six months it felt <laughs> like i've been in a shell for six so it's very hard it very it really hit me very 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 hard mm-hmm. uh for multiple reasons uh um and uh, i didn't expect this kind of a result mm-hmm. so uh, it took a lot out of me to 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 i'm still there trying to cope up come out come out mm-hmm. um uh, so so i i i went for for two two vacations basically mm-hmm. you know went to watch uh, um to see uh, to a tiger safari uh, in todoba it's a nice, it's a uh, uh, it's a reserve forest so and i when i saw the tiger it's it's very rare but that always a place where you can actually you know uh, spot the, spotting a tiger is 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 more uh, chances of spotting a tiger so i i saw it's an exhilarating experience i felt like shit man i saw a tiger in in the wild mm. and then you know took a picture i'm like what well, this is this is more than seeing an eiffel tower or seeing the colosseum mm. and it feel as much excited as i was when i saw it so those little things might look very silly simple or nothing mm. but they will take you out of where you are correct and then <clears throat> try to give you a perspective mm. find a perspective so we are human beings there is only one life life is very 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 precious mm. and uh, imagine what it took for you to transform into this body you know millions of sperms you know fighting for each other mm. with each other to become mm. that one and then mm. you became that one person right correct so out of all odds from your birth till who you are today you're fighting bacteria virus bombs mm. you know crashes accidents everything to to stay alive mm. that means inadvertently or without knowing you are surviving there is a survival instinct in yeah. you you know and then you should be happy that you are alive correct what is the worst thing that can happen death right yeah death yeah that is only to that is the worst thing cinema pote correct you know at flop lo the super hit lo the correct doesn't matter yeah. uh, or you lose a job you lose a girlfriend ah uh, doesn't matter it everything will pass this too shall, shall pass, pass. pass. Yes. Success will also pass. Yeah. yeah. Failure will also pass. Correct. You are alive. You are happy. Surround yourself. Life is very precious. Surround yeah. yourself with people. Correct. Who you like doesn't matter. You know if they like you or not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a good. Keep your mental sanity good. Yeah. yeah. Your, you know, be selfish in a in a way. Yeah. Yeah. You know, be mm-hmm. selfish so that you keep yourself. You know, when you are happy, you're automatically the other person will be happy. Correct. If you are depressed and you know your heart. to uh to handle yeah. or to deal with that everybody around you is also unhappy yeah. right? correct yeah actually yeah. that's what my college professor always used to say about oh. me that this fellow to shall pass <laughs> <laughs> i apologize for that um uh, okay then uh, the second thing um actually that was a very nice point that you know that it never ends yeah. people think that you know okay after i become successful oh, my mental health will be because we associated with success but it's not true that's right no, no. how many successful people went into depression yeah. so i the other day there was an article on times about uh, depression um of, of celebrities um and uh, i should i think 4 5 days ago 
every person goes through depression correct every yeah, person yeah. Yeah. it's okay so uh, the more successful you are the more depressed you will be could be actually yeah, yeah. because that's not the end right it's yeah. not like once you attain the peak mount yeah. everest you know climb this high peak and later you have to sleep wake this up the next day oh uh, no and then do the track again yeah. you know life track so don't think that you know this is it Yeah. No, it's a long haul. You are in for a long haul. Correct. So prepare your ammunition for a longer journey. Every right. day you can't, you can't be on Mount Everest. Yeah, yeah. Some days you feel like jumping from there. Yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. Mm. So cool. So it's a long haul. Prepare for the you know. Yeah, that's actually a great point, man. Thanks. Mm. Um, uh, number two, um, India is now going through some sort of a fitness revolution. Like people are kind of taking care of their bodies. Yeah. Um, any tips for a creative person? Like, is it important? How do you do it? Any anything about like physical fitness? Uh, Keeping I, yourself. See, I would say there is a difference. So I, 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 I a little one experience that I had. So there's something called. Uh, so I used to attend yoga classes in uh, in US. Mm-hmm. Okay, there's this thing called Bikram Yoga, which Correct. is hot yoga. Hot yoga, yes. <laughs> so I went to that class. Me and my colleague, uh, 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 who's my manager at the time. So. Well, it's a one hour class. It's it's hard. It's hot yoga. You get cramps if you have to take a lot of water input, and 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 uh, you have to be really fit uh, to be in one session. Mm. So five minutes into the session, I was cramped up. I had to take water. Uh, then start again. Then every five ten minutes, you know, I had to take a break in a one hour session. Mm. So there is one lady. Uh, she she did back to back one hours. sessions mm. and then she didn't look when you look at her she's lean and all that she didn't look like she had a perfect body mm. and i i asked my 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 you know the guy the colleague plus manager like i mean she she looks like um, she's a little sloppy she looks like she doesn't have a great fitness levels mm. but seems like she has a great fitness yeah and i said he said yeah that's the unfortunate thing what people see is the body and they think you are fit mm-hmm. but what whether you are fit or not is is inside, inside. Mm-hmm. you right so right. you go to the gym make a great body that doesn't mean you are fit mm-hmm. right uh, so uh, so it's endurance yeah uh, it's, it's not stamina. like you have a six pack and then you are no Yeah. Inside, if you might have a six pack, but inside you are, you know, your organs are failing. Yeah. Because of that six pack. Yeah. So healthy is different from you know looking, looking fit. Correct. Looking physically fit is different from you know actually being fit and healthy. Yeah. Uh, right. And mental fitness also is part of uh, yeah. being fit. Yeah. Mm. So don't go by the physical look, but see if you are actually fit. Phys- yeah. You know. Uh, from an endurance point of view, from you know being fit mentally, if you're happy here, mm-hmm. you know your body also reflects correct uh, that. So you know, concentrate on your mental fitness correct, uh, and then trying to be happy. Mm. Um, success is 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 what you define success, not what other person defines success. Mm. So um, you know, for you, success could be crossing this road. Yeah. Uh, are in into are you in traffic lo and if i can cross this road i'm i'm happy to be happy yeah. find happiness in little things yeah. correct and if i can have a coffee you know in the next half an hour i'm happy i'm be happy mm. so like le do le no i will save these for for me to become this you know you know uh, astronaut or then moon landing just then i'm happy until then i'm miserable and you'll be miserable all your life correct even after yeah. the moon landing even after the moon landing <laughs> Correct. Yeah. Then by the you know when you land on moon you're like intena. Correct. Yeah. The Because you put them. all your like you packed all your hopes on. Correct. That. And then you don't know what to do next. Correct. Mm. Correct. Mm. Correct. And if you're used to like passing one day at a time, then that would be more. You're happy every day, so yeah. you're enjoying the process of you know in doing or achieving what you're doing. Correct. So you it doesn't really matter. Yeah. So you will achieve moon landing, but it yeah. it's okay. Not the moon landing. Let me you know try Mars. Correct. Okay. So you do you guys watch South Park? Yeah. I do. There is lot. I would say Bhagwat Gita lo enta. Yeah, those guys are genius. Oh uh, my Mark. God, man! Mm-hmm. Oh my God! There's an episode in South Park where uh, Cartman is my favorite character. <laughs> yeah. Um, Eric Cartman, right? Yeah. Um, so they they are into this, this uh, video games. 
right? So, uh, so they 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 gang up on these online games and they they they, they sit for ten days, fifteen days, and they win. Finally, they win, and they're like, "What next?" To us? <laughs> okay, what do we do now? Now it's like you know we won the war. Like what is it like? Let's do it again. <laughs> But then you're like, so it's lost. So the the writers are genius. Yeah, they are. I would say you know everybody should. It's still adultish, but yeah, but. Uh, No, but as a comedian, as a like you know, as somebody who writes humor, I feel like South Park really pushed the boundaries oh, yeah. of yeah. what you can joke about, right? right. They, yeah. they are, and and it's so informative, so yeah. today's world, you know, um, uh, so true. Correct. Oh, and a lot of depth in in the writing. True, true. It's not just you know superstar. Yeah, it's amazing that like you're a South Park fan, man. Like, you no, know, I yeah. <laughs> yeah. And uh, here's my final question. I'm sorry yeah. we kept you like no, so long. No, I no, I kind of enjoyed it. Yeah. yeah. So, um, for people of today, for youngsters of today, managing their time is very, very difficult. Also, it's crucial and it's difficult because just look at the distraction they are surrounded <laughs> by, right? Mm. Like when we grew up, probably okay, a movie on a TV was a distraction. Right. Mm. Internet with that slow, you know, they see Baba, but that was a distraction. <laughs> right. But uh, now it's they are surrounded by distraction. Right. So, um, what tip would you give to a youngster who is aspiring to become a filmmaker or not? Uh, to better manage their time to better manage their time see if it, it, it's different for every person right it it depends on who you are as person correct what do you do though like do you have some tools or um to manage see i, I like you said either i'm very lazy or very well, active well, correct so i'm not in between correct so um you know when i'm active it's a, i always plan there is a planning but the planning came from my workplace in india oh so i i had again to, to extend this conversation mm-hmm. um i had three bosses in india who shaped me who i am who shaped my personality i have to always give that credit to them uh because i was i i was also a, a very you know a, a a kid who who didn't have a, a sense of direction uh who didn't you know who was very um uh very sporadic and uh, restless um and no patience and all that so my 10 years in ibm from a a a, 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 a an entry level uh, guy to uh, leading a team learned a lot Mm. learned a lot which worked which is working in my work environment environment and also as person my mm. personality kind of built there so i have my first boss was a malaysian boss who's like a you know whip cracker mm. he would say this is what i want spreadsheet chase the spreadsheet lo font ent undali ye bold lo undali left in end undala center in end undala font size enti ఇటాలిక్స్ ఉండాలా లేదా హెడర్ ఎల్లో పెట్టాలి ఎల్లోలో ఏ షేప్ పెట్టాలి రెస్ట్లెస్ ఇంపేషన్ లైక్ దిస్ నాట్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ రైట్ దిస్ ఇస్ నాట్ వాట్ వీ డూ ఐ మీన్ దిస్ ఇస్ దీస్ ఆర్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ థింగ్స్ దీస్ ఆర్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ థింగ్స్ వెన్ యూ సి ఫస్ట్ ఇంప్రెషన్స్ ఆర్ ఆల్వేస్ ద బెస్ట్ ఇంప్రెషన్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు పుట్ ఇన్ దట్ ఎఫర్ట్ ఫిల్ యూ సో i didn't read this there was one incident where i threw papers this is idea like not you know a film set mm. and then walked away because right. it's to, a filmy thing to do yeah <laughs> <laughs> well uh, but, uh, and he was my manager i walked off and i'm like what the fuck what did i do <laughs> <laughs> he didn't say next day morning i came um he didn't say anything i said i went and i said uh, okay man I'm, i'm sorry it's okay for me um so let me know when you're done with the speech <laughs> when i did that so finish that the whole thing so um he was uh, he was uh, my manager for a year he moved on to a different project a new manager came in um this guy was in malaysia new one is american americans are like chill down and okay, do it they give you first chance but when he came in he didn't know anything about the project so i was there uh, on the project for like 3 years so the, he was very nervous like he didn't know what the hell did i come into it all first one hour i gave him a breakdown of what the project is and what we did and what we supposed to do and then he got up and he hugged me he said thank you you know thanks for it i was so nervous um and uh, you know just 
you know, it's gone now. I know that it's all sorted, that you are, you know, in control of everything. And that's what freaking I realized. Shit, the reason why I'm in control without me knowing that I'm in control is because of that hard work that I did. Yeah, with the previous boss. The previous the previous boss. boss. So sometimes you hate your boss, but he's actually, the, he's coming from a place where you don't know. Yeah. Right? So, so you should always, you should, don't jump into judging somebody. Mm. Don't jump into concluding, concluding, you know, why he's behaving a certain way. He's coming from a place where you, you weren't there. Mm. Uh, try to take a step back and think where he's coming from and see if you can learn something from that. Mm. Uh, so every person, you know, from a kid to a, to a 90 year old has something for you, you know, to teach you. Uh, but what is the question? No, <laughs> no, no, the time management. Actually. You learned it from time your... Right? Yeah. So, so, so I guys, just, like, yeah. use the tools that you have. Correct. Right. You learn. See, it's not about time management. Mm. Um, it comes, boils down to time management when you when you see the bigger picture, right? Mm. When you start, when you learn from everything around, surrounding mm. you, from mm. successful people, from people who failed, mm. uh, from people who, you know, didn't have luck, but much more talented than you are. Mm. It's just, Luck, right? Film industry is all about luck. Yeah. Being in the right place at the right time. Sending the right message at the right mm. time. Correct. Yeah. Right? You must, you could be much more talented than the next person, but hey, mm. never ever complain. Mm. Who you are today is because of who you are. Not because of what your father did to you, mm. or your brother did to you, mm. or your friends did to you. Correct. That's you, 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 you are who you are because yeah. you still have time. Even if you are six years old you still have time to shape up your life it's in your hands mm. yeah. when you stop complaining is when you become you will become somebody mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. take it upon yourself it's because of you mm. accept accept it accept yourself right. yeah. Yeah, accept, you know. mm. see you, nobody knows how to uh, parent right <laughs> They yeah. take your parents for them. They have learned on the job. On the job, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you are the yeah, experiment. I'm learning on my job. Correct, correct. Correct. I'm learning how to parent. Nobody, there's no book. There are tons of books, but you know, there yeah. are. Uh, so you learn. So so they did their best, dude. Yeah. And now, now we are the, like, yeah. We now are our parents' experience. Right, yeah. yeah. And then you take their experiences. You don't do the same mistakes. Yeah. And then you try to become better. You think you're better than them, right? But your child will again be like, oh, <laughs> this is yeah. a never ending journey, I guess. It's not. See, and again, I've realized now that I'm a parent and I've, I've seen half my life, like, it's a, it's like you have to reinvent the wheel all over again. Mm. You, they, they see, you know, me, my father, they, he'll tell you from his experience, you will not listen. Mm. Yeah. Because you can't see where he's coming it's from. Coming from correct, you correct. have to experience it yeah. for you to understand. Aha, Anduka. Yeah. By the time you experience this, you're, you're oh. 40. Yeah. Mm. Then you you give the same can to your kid. Yeah. And, and he also like, like, he's he's not saying it. Yeah. 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 And then you're like sitting, you look at your dad, thanks dad. And, yeah. like it and he'll learn someday. Yeah. <laughs> That's very apt actually, reinventing the wheels. You have, yeah. Yeah, it's, everybody has to go through those experiences. Yeah. But you will become successful when you learn from others' experiences. Mm. You will not have, your lifetime is not enough to experience everything, right? Correct. Mm-hmm. So you absorb everything yeah. mm. from, from the universe. You learn from the universe yeah. and you put your own perspective. Yeah. Mm. Don't take take it for the face value. Mm. A lot of people, you know, buy to put camera, everybody will say that they've conquered the world. That's not who they, those people are. Mm. There is, you know, there is a dark side to them. Mm. There is a downside to them. There is, they have gone through a lot. Right? So, try, try to learn from that. And then apply it to, to your life. Well, too much gyan, I guess. No, 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 no that's no, what no, we good. wanted. Actually, yeah, that's no. what I thought. Like, in yeah. conclusion, uh, if you ever get bored of your film career, yeah. like you got of your job in the US or engineering <laughs> in India, you would make for a very good motivational speaker. Oh, wow. Uh, I think you have clarity, brevity, <laughs> yeah. oh, yeah. and uh, some sort of empathy when you speak. Wow. So, Thank you. I, it comes from my life. You know, uh, yeah, it comes from what I've experienced. Okay. I've been at the rock bottom, I mean, no, having no confidence, a kid with, you know, who had no clue what to do. Yeah. To somebody, you know, and like, yeah, I can do this. Mm-hmm. Or, uh, like you said, if I'm bored of filmmaking, I'll, I'll probably so- find something else. You know? Motivational speaker. <laughs> no, but anyway, uh, coming to filmmaking, is it 
any project that you're working now that's going to come uh, um i do you want sure, to tell i don't, i'm sure running a series for amazon mm-hmm. right now. um i haven't thought about my next film yet mm-hmm. i want to take some time you know i i haven't written sat down written anything i want to kind of go back and write mm-hmm. something uh, will manifest that once the next film comes again you come back here okay, well, yeah yeah Well, thank you so much. Thank you for being our first guest. Thank well, you for being. Thank you for calling me. Yeah, no, I was like, like it was fun because we were tense <laughs> because we have not done this earlier. <laughs> yeah. So, so yeah. please uh, overlook our flaws if well, we interrupted yeah. or interjected. Oh no, cool. no, no, no! It's fun. It's, so it, it has to be more casual. It's like you know. Yeah.